Alrighty, before we head off, Jess said I need to go check the luggage, see if we packed enough stuff. So she said check out hers. Okay, that's, that's a bit of stuff, alright. Um, Hunters. Whew. I mean, I'm gonna say a little bit excessive, but um, let's check out mine. Oh, I see where she's trying to save space on the luggage. What is that? <laughs> I don't know which one to choose. What do you think? Um, <laughs> you, you just pick one. Alrighty, Hunter, we need to save space. What are we going for? White? Yeah? Or shall we go for a yellow one? Just like your mother. We've just realized that it has been six months since we've been on a plane, and the last time we were on a plane, we were heading back from Hawaii, and little Hunter was still in my belly. And since then, we've bought a house, we built a nursery, we've had a baby. <laughs> And Hunter is now 10, ten weeks old. old and we're about to head off on our first little adventure. We're going up inside Western Australia to the top to a place called Broome. It's about a two and a half hour flight. So. It's tropical. It's 30 degrees and sunny every single day that we're going to be there. This is her first time that she's going to experience like warm weather. First time we can put her in like a little dress, a little shorts, a little t-shirt. I'm very excited about that. Take her to the pool. <laughs> There's first, a lot of things we're excited first about. First time going on a plane. Let's just start with that. <laughs> but we just packed and we are impressed. I want to show you. So these are the two travel bags that we always take with us even before Hunter and we were able to put our stuff plus a little new section for Hunter in there. All fit and then the two additional things is just her travel cot and her pram which are actually free. So if you have an infant when you're flying Qantas you can actually bring a cot, a pram and a car seat all for free which we didn't know about and we thought that was pretty cool. And then we have a little collection here of things for Hunter on the plane seeing as she's uh, luckily she's only 10 weeks so this here, the most entertainment ever, which is perfect. And then I guess we just have over here our all our camera gear again in the bags that we normally take. The only difference is now there's a couple of nappies, a couple of wipes, ready to go. How you feeling? Feeling good? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. She's sleeping right now. Do you want to see her? She doesn't even know what's about to happen. She wakes up. We're gonna go to the airport. Bags are all packed, heading to the airport, and we're all super thankful that we live in Western Australia because our state borders have been closed. No one from over east can come in, so we're kind of in this little bubble, and we've had, I think, over a hundred days since community transmission. So our premier, who runs our state, has made flights cheap within WA to kind of promote everyone to go explore your own backyard, and that's how we're able to go up to Broome today. It feels so weird being back at the airport. <laughs> Quick cuddles with aunt. Yeah. Hello, baby. Come on. <laughs> she doesn't know what's going to happen. I'm going to miss Mama. you. I'm going to miss you so much. You big girl. Oh, hello. Look at the world. <gasps> this is called the airport. Yeah. <gasps> this is the place that takes <gasps> you to all these different amazing oh, places in the world. Look at that. Um, you got some additional baggage there, which we've never done before. This is so exciting. Lay, lay your head down I like having you around to call you baby What you got there? Is this your very first boarding pass, madam? Is that your name? What? <laughs> her first role as flightless assistant is she's going to be the one that looks after all our passports. Aren't you? You got them all safe? Yeah. Are you in the morning? Let it burn all Collect into that. I'll pull 
octopus. I think. She's all strapped in. Oh, are you ready for your takeoff? We're gonna go one, two, three. <laughs> She's already got her feet out, ready to go. So we just have to get told how to um, do the seatbelt. Now she's strapped in. When you're only counting time to the continents collide But out your wind Ready for vacay. You look like this is the first time you've seen the heat before, <laughs> and it's 6 pm at night. Alright, girl, are you ready to vacation? on vacation. So only last yeah. week this little one started swimming lessons so are you ready to have a dip in a pool Baba? We need to show everyone what you've been learning. <laughs> All right, Hunter, this is your first vacation pool of many. I know right now you're not phased, but this is to future Hunter. I bet you when you're like a couple of years older, we're going to be jet lagged and you're going to be like, Dad, I need to go to the pool. I just want to swim. So this is for future proof. He's going to um, do this. <laughs> hey, class. Just enjoy the water. <laughs> hey, class, we're just in the nursery rhymes. Mm -hmm. and I'm learning just to enjoy the water. Hey. Shipwreck on shore feels like I was here before. Tell me there's something more. This fire, you know what I love? What? Everyone's parked their cars down here. We parked our pram. How funny does it look when you've got all these cars at our little spot? Hey, uh, this is one of the most beautiful sunsets here on the west coast. Do you want to come out? Ready, Baba? All right, Hunter. So this is Cable Beach, one of the most famous beaches here in Australia. And do you know what is so special about it? Look behind us right now. See There's some camels. So we actually came here a couple of years ago, just me and Jess. Hunter wasn't even like a thought at the time. And we actually went on the camel ride. It's a really cool experience. You go up and down the beach and there's this bit where there's a bit of a mirror because of the water. And it's spectacular, definitely the best way to see a sunset. And I, I didn't think we'd be here two years later with... A little bubble. Oh, 
lover. Just realized you guys are matching, aren't you? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, this is risky. We've decided to bring fish and chips down to a beach. I see seagulls everywhere. Hold on, <laughs> this one coming. <gasps> oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to have a nice meal on the beach. Always. 